You are a beast. Um, honestly? That looks like an okay hand to me. You don't hang around, do you? Okay. I'll kill that thing quickly. Okay. Why is that conveil thing? Looks nasty. Perfect in that one of a bud quite quickly. Another blaze, eh?
Basically, screw it at this point, I think. Yeah, you're going to one-shot me this next turn. I think my deck can beat that deck if it gets a good draw. Two blinks and a Reku. I'll take it. I'm sorry I'm not being a bit quiet right now. Okay, I can now get my first blinks out there. And an Oveku.
This is a tough fight. Kill you. I know you're going to kill my blinks this turn. Fuck that. Gee, bro. Okay.
Oh gosh, you killed my um, big blinks. That works. Okay. Bugger you. I know I'm going to lose this game, but I don't care. <sighs> what happens when you run out of cards, I wonder? We got no more cards. That's what happens.
literally, this game went down to um, a pack where he literally couldn't do any more damage to me because he ran out of cards. A mass has been defeated. Reen wins. Guess that does it. Yes, that's number win. But Musa and Ash are still playing. Right, that all you got? What the hell? Three vanishes of 18 points? You're kidding me. How long have you been Rose? Don't tell me you were. You ain't gonna say a cheat without proof, are you? Just common sense to hold on to your best move to the end. No, I like you. That's the end of my turn. At the end of the game, I lost. I say using uptide in round three, sort of that. You're about to think so far ahead. I wouldn't go that far. It's time to have good draws. Um. So, everyone. I'm surprised they were able to make a comeback. Each of them displayed an impressive amount of strategy. Ash probably cheated, but it's good enough to hide it. Oh, me. Didn't think all three of us would slip up. Guess I really am getting old. I didn't feel like you won. Not only did my students have to come in and save me, but you gave me a second shot when you were winning. Yeah, but a win's a win. I keep my promises. Time for your reward. I'll answer a few questions for you. The thing I showed you is called Zector. Sorry, that's the most I'm going to say on that one. Okay. You mean what we saw in Sutherland? Zector. Feels like a suitable name for a Divine Knight. Here's what else I want to know. Including Zephyr, I've noticed four groups in action. That makes you, Red Constellation, Nidhogg, and an unidentified group of Purple Jaegers. What's someone's objective? Here we go, straight shooter. Bigger, did ask. Each core's got a different objective. We can break it down on two sides. One side, you got Red Constellation and most Purple Jaegers. On the other side, you got us, Nidhogg, hired by the government. The government's hired to Jaegers? That does clear up some things. And the teams are in line with what we expected. Just make sure, Zephyr and Nidhar go on the same side, but you weren't hired by the government. Right. Exactly. We got some new interest, so we're just choosing to back them up. Bet you already know who hired us. And you probably already know who Red Constellation is siding with society. Brings us to why you don't know the identity of the Purple Jaegers. Surely you've realized who they are by now. Sarah Valestine. The dead soldiers who, even after losing the Northern War, couldn't throw their pride away. The deserters from the Northern Jaegers. Huh? The Northern Jaegers? Uh, are they? They're a large-scale Jaeger Corps, which was based in the former North Ambria state. I was afraid of this, Sarah. <sighs> <laughs> hey, hold up! We won! And you're not giving us Jack besides a name and who's backing who? What can I say? We're fine with letting a little secret slip out here and there. But you ain't earned more than that. I think that's plenty for now. Um. Oh, we were saving winning hand cards. <sighs> Screw off. I knew it. I will say, though, those were some solid matches. This was fun. Later. Should the chance come, let's play again. He was literally just not killing me. He let me win. Look at his cards. Bet was his hand. He could have dealt little damage with his combination. Would have been free to play him at the end. He was going easy on us. That goes here, and this goes there, I see. Well, look at his master. Was he cheating too? I don't think he was. He was just that good. Well played, Jaeger King. Well, as you said, a win's a win. We got some answers. Didn't sound like much, but what he said spoke volumes. You should be proud, Ween. You do as well, Muse and Ash. Hmm. Ah, oh, thank you. No prob. Should have said it first. Thanks for helping us. But you will explain why you're in a casino and supervised, I'm sure. Oh dear, I've suddenly become lightheaded. I have such an intense match and cannot speak. Wait, we're only here because we're... Okay. 
You don't get a free pass just because you know how to play a guard game. Unacceptable. You have acted about leave again and again. Why exactly do you feel like it was necessary to chase after and talk to Schwarzer? We have no excuses. Major, I've already given him a harsh warning. I think that may be enough. Silence. This is my Tomatasca's commanding officer. Disregarding the rules and sneaking about is unacceptable. To make sure it's clear, I'm going to drill it into our skulls from now until it lights out. Staying up to the latest tale of my complexion. I've already wiped out. Can you be a bit short? They're good, they're good kids, except those two. That's a shame, but it is what it is. A little tough love every now and then, all doing good. It just feels wrong. I mean, we have a reason why we got information from the Yager King. You can worry about the punishment some other time. By now, we should be focusing on what we learned. Yeah. We're dealing with a bunch of units from Norman Yeagers, people from the Annex North Ambria. Been half a year since the annexation and the end of the Northern War. Most of the Northern Yeagers have drafted into the army. Still a large number of them went AWOL. That's right. Until now, they were believed to have fled to the Midwest. They thought we'd encounter them here in Lamar. Given that we're wearing new gear, do you think the society is backing them? Well, it seems to be on the same side of the Wednesday Constellation, so possibly. Oh, wait, anyone else surprised if we Empire hired Nidhug? Better share a bit of information with the RMP. But here, the Intelligence Division often hires Jaegers with Black Ops. Lecter should be able to shine some light on that if we ask him tomorrow. That's enough for Reed Welt. You may be off duty, but it's not your place to collect classified government information. Try to remember you're foremost representative of the RMP. Forgive me. Message came from HQ. You'll be behind Dar by sunrise. As the rest of you, you may depart tomorrow morning. It's already late after all. Sheesh, I know it's a job to be stone faced, but would have given him lighted up a little. It's pretty sweet when it really comes down to his students, really. It's true. It stuck so in two masters, but it does try. Seriously, you should have seen when he first started. It's softened up quite a bit. Is that so? Okay, we shared the information we learned today with the relevant parties. Dr. Sarah, Mary Claire, why don't you take the guest room tonight? Well, thank you for your hospitality. That's our terror, always ready for anything. Oh, you're too kind. Angie, why did you bunk with me? Angie, Toa. So adorable. Of course, you're not sleeping. Many can fall asleep so quickly. I say it's proof you're a good soldier. We've got a lot to talk about. It's the first time in a year they've seen each other. Moves out tonight. Maybe we'll go get some fresh air. And you know what? You know the episode here. It's actually been two episodes since I last ended the episode. I'll probably stuff all that card game and stuff into one episode. But anyway, until then, have a wonderful day and bye bye.